Good Friday, everyone. This is meteorologist Dave Snyder at the National Weather Service with Alaska Statewide Weather. Several waves of low pressure are working through the Bering Sea this afternoon, spinning warmer air further and further northward. There are some areas of snow out across the southern Seward Peninsula, including areas around Nome and the northern YK Delta, as well as the middle Yukon Valley. Warmer air continues to work its way northward, and that'll set up a better chance for snow in the Brooks Range but start to move us toward a area of mixed precipitation for the west coast, the Seward Peninsula, and parts of the YK Delta as we head into the weekend. That could include snow, freezing rain, and even some ice. For southeastern Alaska, rain is the main precipitation player this afternoon. Low pressure is still sitting across the eastern Gulf. It's a weaker wave at 1,003 millibars and a stronger area of low pressure just south of the central and western Aleutians at 976 millibars is going to keep a occluded front just south of the chain for a good part of tonight and into early tomorrow. And along that boundary, winds are starting to pick up, though, and gales are in effect for areas of the western Bering Sea and all along the western and central chain that will go through Saturday and Saturday night. For areas along St. Lawrence Island from Doll Point to Wales, heavy freezing spray warnings are in effect there Saturday all the way into the afternoon. And a small craft advisory is also in effect through Saturday afternoon. Gales are also up for early Saturday morning for Flaxman Island to Demarcation Point in the eastern Beaufort Sea Coast. Looking ahead to Saturday, a 1,034 millibar high across the Chukchi Sea will drop a little bit further southward, pushing some colder air into the eastern and central parts of the Brooks Range. Cold, a cold front is dropping southward along that, and again, that'll start up a better chance for snow from Kaktovik to Prudhoe Bay and Dead Horse all the way through the Kotzebue Sound region and the northern tip of the Seward Peninsula through the Bering Strait. Around the interior, more clouds than anything else. A partly to mostly cloudy sky should be expected through a good chunk of the weekend. A little more sunshine perhaps on Saturday midday. A few flurries around Fairbanks for Saturday afternoon. For south central, most of the precipitation will linger around the Gulf Coast. Periods of rain mixed with some areas of uh, snow at times, primarily rainfall during the day. Look for light rain across southeastern Alaska and again several waves of low pressure to the uh, south and west along the chain, a 975 millibar low passing east of Adak and Atka by Sunday afternoon will push an occlusion up across the Pribilovs, keeping precipitation there closer to rainfall by the end of the weekend. With Alaska statewide weather, this is meteorologist Dave Snyder. Find us online anytime at weather.gov.